Midland Funding is a debt buyer, probably the largest debt buyer in the country right now. What they do is uh, they buy pools of old, charged off, delinquent credit accounts. Let's say you had a credit card with JCPenney, and because of some financial difficulty, you fell behind, couldn't make your payments, and after a while of making phone calls and sending you collection letters, JCPenney just decides to quit collecting from you. Okay? Well, it's not over because Midland comes to JCPenney and asks if they can buy that account from them. Okay? And they'll buy pools of these accounts, thousands and thousands of people. And what they're really buying is your information. They're buying the names, the addresses, the social security numbers, telephone numbers, account numbers of the thousands of customers that uh, are attached to the accounts that JCPenney charged off that month. And they get a big data tape with all this personal information and they start hitting you for money. They'll run your credit report using all your personal information to try and find out where you live, where you work, if you've paid anything off lately. And they'll send you letters asking for money. Now, most of these letters don't come from Midland Funding. They'll come from a separate company called Midland Credit Management, which I don't know why they do this, but for some reason, Midland has decided to split itself into two companies, one of which actually owns the debts and sues people. The other one just collects and makes phone calls and sends out letters. Well, if you don't pay what they're asking for, there's a good chance Midland will sue you. Okay, some debt buyers don't sue people just as policy. They don't. They try to collect by other means. Midland does it. They will take you to court. And uh, even though they might present what looks like evidence against you, very often, uh, most if not all Midland funding cases could be beaten by a decent lawyer. I've been to court against Midland about probably eight times in just the past year, and I've never gotten beaten by Midland. I, I always win. Um, the reason is they just don't ever have any evidence, okay? And um, unfortunately, nobody really seems to know this, at least no consumers do, because Midland still makes tons of money. They're insanely profitable. Midland is owned by a company called Encore Capital. And Encore Capital, it owns Midland Funding and a couple of other junk debt buyers in, in the same business. And in February 2010, Encore's stock was $15 a share, all right? Today, it's over $40. Now, that's incredible. I mean, that means they've almost tripled in value during the past five years, okay? Nobody gets those kind of returns unless, you know, you're some sort of startup. It's just incredible. And the entire reason they're so profitable is because ordinary people, the folks that are being... Uh, squeezed for money by Midland, they have no idea that if they just don't go down without a fight, if they stand up to these guys, that they could, you know, avoid having to pay them anything at all. So if you've been sued by Midland, it's very important to answer the complaint, okay? Just don't fall for the trick. 